The Moon For centuries mankind has marveled at its celestial beauty. So much so, that there was a race war between the USSR and the United States to be the first to reach it. But did you know that there are some who believe the entire moon landing was a hoax? On July 20, 1969, the world celebrated as Neil Armstrong took the first steps on the moon. This achievement marked the end of the space race and cemented the United States as the first to put a man on the moon. It would be the greatest accomplishment of mankind to date. However, there are many who believe the moon landing never happened and that the whole incident took place on the set of a movie studio. While this idea might sound far-fetched, their arguments to support their theories aren't easy to dismiss. It all started with a man called Bill Kazing and his pamphlet about America's $30 billion swindle. It began as a hunch, before turning into a true conviction, that the US lacked the technology to make it to the moon or, at least, to the moon and back. This caused many to question the authenticity of the many photos taken from the mission. One of the photos shows the lunar module after landing. Many argued that the craft would have made a small impact crater upon touchdown. Another argument that comes up often, is the lack of stars in the photos taken from the moon. Many state that the stars should be visible if they were truly on the moon. This, however, was dismissed, claiming that it was technically daytime on the moon and that the sun's immense rays toned out the stars, similar to daytime on Earth. Some non-moon landing believers say, that getting to the moon would have been impossible due to the astronauts and their equipment having to pass through the deadly Van Allen radiation belts, which circle the planet and are made up of energetically charged particles. It's important to note that the temperatures in the belts range from 3,140 degrees Fahrenheit to 35,540 degrees Fahrenheit. According to many, none of the equipment nor the astronauts would have survived such temperatures. However, according to a Professor Oja, the equipment and the astronauts passed through them with such speed that the damage was minimal, comparing it to the art of firewalking. Another popular topic that comes up, the flag appears to be waving in the vacuum of space where there is no wind. This argument was dismissed though, with NASA saying the flag is rigged with a pole and the waving pattern was purposely done. So, what are your thoughts on the moon landing? Do you believe it really happened? Or do you believe the whole thing was a hoax just to win the space race? Drop a comment and let me know what you think. And as always, thank you for watching.